Hello and welcome to Dr. Ajit Saxena's channel. Today I'm going to talk about a very important factor that is male hormone. It's a very powerful hormone and has a lot of actions in the body. It makes a man male. If the testosterone level is deranged, then a lot of conditions start occurring. I'll talk about that a bit later. But in the body, the testosterone is available as total testosterone and free testosterone. There's also a bioavailable testosterone. We, we won't talk about that because the most important ingredient of testosterone or the active testosterone is free testosterone. And this level has to be uh, of an adequate level for a man to function actively and brightly. If the free testosterone level is low and indeed the total testosterone is also low, then patient suffers from a lot of problems. Or, and what are these problems? Let's, let's start with the sexual problems that occur. Testosterone is involved in both erectile function as well as desire problems. It's a very integral part of good sexual performance. If the testosterone level is low, the first thing to go is the erectile function and the man is not able to keep up his erections if he does get one at all. The first thing to appear is erectile dysfunction and the first thing to recover also is erectile dysfunction. Apart from that, it affects the brain in memory, in improving the sharpness. If a person feels lethargy, feels uh, he's unable to concentrate and in general feels weak. All these symptoms can be due to a deficiency of testosterone. How many times? So many times we have come across such patients in our clinic and we give them B vitamin B12 or vitamin C, whatever, and hope that the things will improve. I'm reminded of a teacher of mine when I was a student and he would go around the ward and say injection testosterone. Every second person he would give an injection testosterone. And we used to think, why the hell does he do that? Has he got some shares in that company? 30 years later, uh, now I realize that what he was saying was true. These persons had low testosterone level and therefore they were suffering from what is known as andropause or late onset hypogonadism as it's technically known as. And all we have to do, do is to replace the testosterone to a level where it, it can function properly. So I always tell my tell doctors whenever I lecture that if a man comes to you depressed, not looking very active, as lethargy and he complains of sexual dysfunction, think of the male hormone. It's a very easy test to do. You take a blood sample and calculate the total and free from that. Indeed, Arousal problems are mostly due to male hormone deficiency. Similarly, in females also, testosterone is supposed to play a role in proper sexual functioning, but the quantity there is very low. If you look at this diagram that I've got here, it affects the brain, it, it affects the muscles. The, in a low testosterone patient, the muscles are replaced by fat, and this fat typically accumulates in the abdomen region where we get central obesity. It affects the liver, the cardiovascular system, adrenals, and the bone. In fact, it affects all the major organs of the body, and you replace the testosterone in case the level is low, and bingo, you find the patient is a different person altogether. So what do we do for a situation like this, where the te so testosterone level is low? How do we increase the testosterone level or the male hormone level? There are some guidelines which I've given previously in my video particularly sex after 660 there are some guidelines to improve the testosterone level diet is one of the most important things see natural things should, should be done first medicines we've got we can always increase the testosterone level but if you naturally increase it then it stays for a longer time and it's a more effective way of treating testosterone so a change in diet is the first thing that I would advise take green leafy vegetables broccoli is a good one and take vitamins micronutrients they're the way, they're the, those are the very important food with zinc particularly dry fruits are very good for improving the testosterone level there are certain fruits like avocado which has a high content of the male hormone number two exercises are very important exercises release the testosterone which in turn improves the general well-being of the person testosterone level falls for about one nanogram every year from the age of 40 onwards it used to be 40 years of age and every 10 years it will keep on decreasing but now with the present struggle and strains of life the level has come starts lowering from 30 onwards it is responsible for the burnout syndrome as we talk about it and increasingly we are finding executives CEOs who lose their interest in life, lose their interest in daily activities, sexual activities. Whereas the answer was relatively simple in many cases that you give an injection of testosterone or give it orally and it bounces back to normal and they feel better. As I said, natural ingredients should be tried first. Proper sleep is important. But if those things do not work or work very little, then you have to supplement it with medicines. And again, here there are a lot of herbal products available with testosterone in it. Some are good, some are not. There's also an injection of testosterone that's available which we give in certain situations. Otherwise, we can use 
oral medicines to alleviate the symptoms by increasing the testosterone level of the patient. Do not take any medicine without getting your blood levels done of testosterone. It's only if the level is low, then you take these medicines. Best is to see a specialist who will titrate the dose for you. One other thing that I must mention is that a lot of protein supplements that people take, particularly gym goers, wrestlers, they the active ingredient in those is again testosterone in some form or the other. It's steroidal drug. Now this may not be mentioned on the, the cover of the packet and therefore taking large quantities of this testosterone or steroids which are mixed with the protein may result in impotence. So you, here you have a situation where there's a burly man but he can't perform. So stay away from such protein supplements. If you like my video today, press the li like icon. If you have any comments or suggestions, please use the comment section. And oh yes, please subscribe to my channel. Good day.